Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The vision of Doral Academy Charter Middle High School is to set the standard for outstanding student achievement while providing a safe and nurturing academic environment. Good morning, Firebirds! We hope you've had a wonderful week so far and are getting used to your school schedule. That's right, there are many things to keep in mind, such as test dates, fall sports, and school events. I'm Ana Remien. And I'm Valentina Torres. Today is Wednesday, August 28th, 2024. And welcome back to a new edition of Firebird TV. TV. Vale, do you eat school lunch? I have a chance to actually. What's on the menu this week? Here's a lana motilla with a cafeteria mukbang. I'm Juan Jimenez. I have a Wawa leftover sandwich and watermelon slices. I'm Nicole Soteldo and I have school lunch burger, fries, and some chips. Uh, uh, I, won't, uh, I won't eat it, but I'll leave it there. <laughs> oh my god. Eat the takimas. You have to say eat a takimas. Eat a takimas. Eat a takimas. Okay. Mm. Oh. <laughs> okay. Mm. Dry? <laughs> Can you hear this? Mmm. <laughs> Mushy? Honestly, I don't know what's even in here. ASMR. There was a little like spoon of um, ice cream and I was playing with it. So I suddenly went like this and it flew onto a girl's hair and I got attention. Where you been? I want to talk about, you know what I want to talk about? Let's get like political Real. here. Why are the world's famous chocolates $2 now? Someone told me about that. Am I lying? Oh my god. What was, that one thing, what was that one thing Kanye said? He was like, they're putting Snickers, they're making Snickers to make us fatter. Make the, they make the Twix bigger, they're trying to make us fat, you know what I mean? Keep the talking about no, Okay. Yeah. 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 Anna, do you know what's going on in school this week? No, but to keep you guys updated, here's your school announcements. The last day to apply to NHS is September 26. Make sure to do so if interested. If you're interested in photography, the Photo Club will be having their first informational meeting September 27th at 2.40 p.m. in the media room. Picture day is September 10 and 11 during your English class. Make sure to purchase your photo album online. To celebrate the beginning of the school year, the Back to School Middle School dance is on September 5th from 6 to 8 p.m. Make sure to show up. Middle School TV production applications are now open and there will be an informational meeting on September 12th. Technology is a big part of everyone's lives. Children especially are getting introduced to it at a young age. There's many disadvantages and advantages. Here's Arrele Lapolo with more. As technology evolves and becomes more common, young children start getting introduced to it earlier and earlier, making the impact it has on children development greater. Here at Coloring Dream Staker in Miami, we learn what teachers do to overcome the obstacles and how it has impacted the children and their teaching. Por lo general, la tecnología tiende en ocasiones, cuando se usa en, en horas muy prolongadas, en horarios muy extendidos, a que los niños se, se angustien, se les crea ansiedad y se pongan un poquito inquietos. Entonces, es, es importante que establezcamos desde un principio en el uso de la tecnología con niños pequeños, horarios, límites. Therapists such as those of speech and behavior agree that technology should have limits and could even have positive results when these are implemented. Mientras que lo usemos de una buena forma, hay, hay app que sirven como para aprender en un corto tiempo, pero mientras que lo usamos solo para ver videos o cosas que no son beneficiosas, creo que no. 
si lo dejas por mucho tiempo un niño y no le pones un, un tiempo y solo dejas ver YouTube, no entendemos que hay programas o que puede ser beneficioso para un niño en un tiempo determinado, pero no exagerado, o sea, no cinco horas, seis horas diarias. Siempre creo que hay que controlarlo. Para que logremos que sea que impacte en los niños de manera positiva, necesitamos tener claro el objetivo y utilizarla con un propósito. Es decir, mientras que tengamos claro el propósito de por qué estamos utilizando la tecnología y establezcamos nuestros límites, va a, ser, eh, va a impactar en los niños de manera positiva. In the end, technology can have extensive benefits or harm for children. It all depends on how it is used. Reporting for Fiverr TV, I'm Anarela Polo. Since fall sports are officially starting their season, it's safe to say that we're excited. Here's your daily sports report to keep you updated with all your athletic news. Firebirds, my name is Michael Gonzalez here with today's sports report. Yesterday, our boys and girls golf team went up against Divine Savior Academy, taking the victory with a 24 stroke difference for boys and 83 for the girls. Also, our girls volleyball team had a flawless victory against Downtown Doral with the final score of 3 0. With 9 kills, 4 blocks, and a .66 hitting percentage, Aaron McMullen was determined to starting this season strong. The game went really well. We're a really new team, and I think that we really connected very well. In other news, our Doral football team will be playing against Matter Academy in Melander Park at 7 p.m. Make sure to come out and support our fellow Firebirds. Our swim team will be competing in their first meet of the season against True North today at 4 p.m. at Miami-Dade Kendall. To end off the week, our cross-country team will compete this Saturday at 7.30 a.m. against Park Vista Cobra Invite at Boca Raton. Reporting from Firebird TV, I'm Michael Gonzalez. Take it away, anchors. Well, that's all for today's show. Make sure to follow us on all our social media platforms at Firebird TV, and we hope you have a, a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. Wednesday.